Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Soraya. I'm so glad you're here with me today. Today I'm working on some coasters. You can see that I'm using my nozzle from my compressor. Um, it makes a lot of noise and that's why I'm not doing it live because of that terrible noise that it makes. But you can see the fabulous colors that it uh, blends together. I mixed all my colors with two parts Floetrol and one part paint as always. Now I've done this on coasters and um, the colors really flow very nicely on the tile but you can also do this on a canvas i do it all the time so uh, feel free to try it out all the colors that i'm using today are liquitex basics uh, they are dioxide purple azo orange um, cadmium yellow um, and a crimson red For anyone who's curious, that beautiful puddle that sits at the bottom there was used for another project. I decided to add a little bit more purple to the middle part there because the orange was just taking over everything. Okay, so this is it all wet still, and I love it. So vibrant. What gorgeous colors. I'm going to let um, this dry, and I will show you. There's a lot of glare here, sorry. I'm going to show you what they look like when they are dry. There won't be any glare. I'll see you back here in just one second. So here they are the next day. It only took the 24 hours to dry and I love the way they look. The colors together work so well off of each other. Look at that. It's really, really beautiful. I'm trying to get an angle so you can see without glare. It's just beautiful though in person. It really is um, a beautiful color combination little bit of cells at the top there really beautiful i'm loving what i see so very happy with this set click on the link you see now to see more of my coasters these are some up close images that i took if you're new to my channel please subscribe don't forget to hit the notification bell and give this video a thumbs up Check out my Facebook group called Soraya Silvestri Artist, Amazing Abstracts, Semi-Abstracts and Pores. The link is in the description area below.